Hey everyone, in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to completely uninstall any applications on your Mac. And the simple process of just dragging an application to the garbage can actually leaves a lot behind. So I wanna show you how to fully uninstall any applications correctly on your Mac. I'll show you the manual process and I'll show you a software I use too, but you could use any one of the two I'm gonna show you. So the first thing we wanna do is we wanna find our applications folder. So Finder is where I'm gonna find that. I'm gonna select Finder here and then go to Applications. If you don't see Applications here though, if you go to Go up here, you could search for Applications from here, which should open up the Finder window. Now here, what people typically do is they find the application they wanna delete and they just grab that application, like this one, and then they put it over here in the garbage can and then they'll type in their password and that should delete this application, but applications don't come by themselves. They actually have a lot of supporting documents and system files that won't be deleted this way and you'll leave a lot behind on your Mac. So what should you do instead of just dragging this to the garbage can? I'll show you with this app as an example, VLC. You wanna come up to the search bar and type in the exact app name here and on here, I'm gonna to go to the application folder here, and you can see this is VLC, but there's other things related to VLC that show up as well that I want to delete. But by default, everything that you want is not gonna show up. I need to do one more thing over here. I need to press this plus sign here, and by default, everything that has the name VLC that matches VLC is gonna show up, but if I press plus sign again, I could actually search for things that don't show up, which are under system files. Now, if you don't see system files, go to other instead. And then if you scroll all the way down, this lets you check on system files here by pressing this check mark and press OK. And then it will show up over here, system files. Select that and you wanna make sure are included instead of not included. And you could see few other things showed up over here. Now at this point, what I recommend is, I'm gonna go ahead and just view this in a different format. I could select everything here, and then I could move everything from here to the trash can down here. If you don't feel comfortable doing that, however, I'll show you another option I use that kind of takes some of the guessing work and making sure you don't delete anything you want. But this is the manual way of deleting applications here. Type in your passcode, and just like that, everything related to the applications, including the application itself, has been moved to trash can. And then you could press control and click on your trash can and empty it from here. Now your other option is using an application that has uninstaller. So if I go to this application called Clean My Mac X, it has this option for uninstaller already available. So if I wanted to remove something from here, I could select it and by default, it will show me everything, including preferences and supporting files and login items that come with that application. And I could uninstall it directly from here by pressing uninstall. So if you wanna kinda of do it for yourself option, I'll put a link to Clean My Mac X below in the description of this video. This also does ton of other things, like it takes care of your system junk, does smart scan for malware. And I use this to optimize my Mac anyway, every single week. So I do uninstall application just from here rather than doing it the manual way I showed you. But both of them do work. I just wanted to give you a couple of different options. I hope you found this video useful. Make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe for easy to follow tutorials, and I'll see you next time.